Peace and shalom, family. I'd like to thank you for taking out the time, checking out this video. Make sure you like and subscribe. All right. In this video, I'm going to explain the biblical meaning of sober minded. Also, I'm going to explain areas in our life that we can work to improve our focus. Now that I have your attention, let's go in it. Sober mindedness. Meaning. Living with a single minded focus. To be spiritually minded is life and peace. When we resist temptation and be firm in our faith, having the mind set on spiritual things. The first way to accomplish that is through prayer. Open up your mouth, speak life, call and rebuke out those things and people in your lives that cause you to stumble into darkness. Matthew 15 and 11 says, what goes into someone's mouth does not defile them, but what comes out of their mouth, that is what defiles them. So in other words, what comes out of your mouth is what defiles you. And whatever comes out of your mouth is already in your spirit. When we go to pray, we repent as we're asking the Most High for strength over temptation, for firmer faith, for patience, learning how to hold our tongue, whatever that thing is that you pray for. When the Bible talks about strong drink in the scriptures, it can also mean raging anger. So when you mock your own authority that's you letting that outside noise cause you to err in your vision and stumble in your judgment the more light that enters the eye can result in blurriness and double vision a double minded man has two desires that do not agree with one another. Either you submit to light or you submit to darkness. This is verse 24. No man can serve two masters for either he will have the hate the one and love the other or else he will hold to the one and despise the other. Ye cannot serve God and mammon have you ever seen how people chase money and they follow the money well they chase and they follow the money because it's a false light the bible says to seek ye first the kingdom of heaven and all the righteousness and all these things shall be added unto you neither shall they say low here or though or low there behold the kingdom of heaven is within you A just man walketh in his integrity, for as he thinketh in his heart, so is he. Inwardly measure the spirit and build God's ark. Through soberness, we watch unto prayer. We are children of light. We do not sleep as do others. Do not be deceived by the adversary. Be sober and vigilant. Be steadfast and not wavering. Stay focused and not distracted. Shalom.